اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم فلما احسا ایسا منہم القفر کال من انساری الاللہ قال الحواریون نحن انصار اللہ آمنا باللہ وشہد بأننا مسلمون Dear friends, السلام علیکم ورحمت اللہ وبرکاتہ I recited سورہ آل عمران آیت نمبر 52 In this آیت Allah tells us the message that was conveyed by Prophet Jesus علیہ السلام to Bani Israel So Isa علیہ السلام when he conveyed the message of Allah to them especially the scholars of Bani Israel they were against Isa alayhi salam because they were getting so much money and wealth and so many other luxuries and the worldly things from the people and also they were having so much honor and respect among the people and they were feeling that if they will accept Isa alayhi islam and they will believe in Isa alayhi islam and with the message of what he got from Allah then all the benefits of the world what they are getting they will lose that one and also the honor and respect will be lost so this way they tried their best in order to produce propaganda and some type of tactics in order to make the guidance of Isa alayhi salam false they said that this is the person who is changing our religion who is producing some new things in our religion he is creating disturbance in our society he is producing trouble and inside our country so they have done so many allegations against Isa alayhi salam so this way we read this one we will understand more better Allah said Falamma so when Ahasa felt Isa the Jesus alayhi salam minhum from them from them mean from Bani Israel humul kufra kufra mean disbelieve falamma ahsa Isa min humul kufra so when Jesus alayhi salam he felt from them the disbelief so he felt that these people they are not to believe in him kala then he said man who is Ansari, my helper, ilallah towards Allah. Kala man ansari ilallah. Then he said, Who is my helper towards Allah? Kala al Havariuna. Kala then said, Havariuna. Then the Havari they said, Nahano ansarullah. They said, We are the helper of Allah. Amanna billah, we believe in Allah, washhad, and we certify with witness, be anna muslimun, that we are muslim. So we read one time more. Allah said, Falamma ahassa isa minhumul kufra, kala man ansari ilallah, kala alhawariyuna nahanu ansarullah, آمَنَّا بِاللَّهِ وَشْهَدْ بِأَنَّا مُسْلِمُونَ So when 
Jesus alayhi salam felt from them the disbelief he said who are my supporters in the cause of Allah so the Hawari they said we are supporters for Allah we believe in Allah and we certify with witness that we are Muslim so in this ayat we understand that Isa alayhi salam he preached a lot among the people of Bani Israel he tried his best to convey the message of Allah again and again to the people and he has seen this one also that the scholars of Bani Israel they were against him and they made the people's mind against him and they created the atmosphere within the country that this person is creating some new religion and he is disturbing our religion he is creating the uh, uh, trouble within our society so this way they have done so much propaganda among the people and the minds of the people they made against Isa alayhi salam even Isa alayhi salam he showed miracles of Allah in order to convince them that I am the prophet of Allah I am messenger of Allah I got the message from Allah in the form of Bible and I am just to give you the guidance that is truly from Allah Allah's message to you so but those people so they were under the guidance of their scholars and uh, so they were not to accept him only a few people when Isa alayhi salam he has seen that uh, those people they refused they denied from the guidance of what Isa alayhi salam was conveying to them so they were not accepting that one so when Isa alayhi salam he believed that those people they are not to believe now then he said Kala man ansari ilallah so <coughs> he said eh, who is the helper who is my helper towards Allah that time Kala al-Hawari yuna nahnu ansarullah then that time the Hawari the people nahnu ansarullah they said we are the helper of Allah and they were these Hawari people they were about uh, uh, 12 people and uh, they said amanna billah we believe in Allah washhad and we certify with witness bi anna muslimun that we are muslim you can see from here so they said they are we are muslim they said there was no concept of christianity no Judaism, no any other religion so there was only one religion that was islam this way allah said in holy quran in inna dina in dallah al islam so the uh, deen the religion before Allah is only Islam so Allah only like Islam Islam is the religion that is from Allah so this way the person who follow Islam is called Muslim this way these people who were Hawari who were the helpers of, of Isa al Islam they said washhad bi anna muslimun and we certify with uh, witness that we are Muslim so this way the Christianity and uh, Judaism and some other religion these are the production of the people's mind but actual the real religion that is Islam and the followers are Muslim this way the the companion of Isa al Islam so they were also Muslim this way this is said here washhad bi anna muslimun they said we are Muslim also so we understand now that at the time of Isa alayhi salam when he preached Islam when he conveyed the message of Allah so those people who accepted him they were about 12 people <coughs> so and they were called Hawari Hawari actually is like you can see the Holy Prophet sallallahu when he went to Medina the people of Medina they were called Ansar Ansar mean helper <coughs> and these Hawari they were also the helper Hawar is Hawari mean like the it start from uh, you can see it comes from Hur 
Hur mean the the women who will be in the paradise. Those are called Hur because they will have white color. So this way in the Hur, Havari is the person who has white color. Mostly the people who were with Isa al Islam, <coughs> so they were with the white clothes. Mostly they were just to wear the white clothes. This way they were called Havari. The other thing is that because because of the Isa al Islam's uh, eyes, he was just to uh wash the uh, sinful things of them and he made with the grace of Allah he made their heart full full clean so the clean hearts so they are also this is the other uh, factor that because those people Havari they were they were with clean hearts and they were with the uh, with white clothes so this way they were called Havari so <clears throat> so this is the uh, those people they were called Hawari because of the clean hearts and because of having the uh, white dress and it also it comes in the Bible also the, that uh, uh, those people uh, mostly uh, when Isa al Islam he was to preach near the river or near the lake so uh, w those people mostly they were uh, catching the fish and uh, the fishermen they were also to to whom isa al islam he preached and uh, uh, some people they were also washermen and they were washed the clothes of the people so this way they were uh, to wash the clothes of people so this way those are called hawari so the hawari you know so they were hawari is the person who has clean heart and having the white clothes and uh, so this way those people they became the companion of Isa al Islam like the Sahaba of Holy Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. So they were twelve and when then Isa al Islam he trained them, he gave them education and trained them, then after that he sent these Hawari people to the different parts of the world so to convey the message of Allah to the people also, to the Bani Israel people. So this way uh, Isa al Islam when he said to the people <coughs> when he he has seen that the people are not to accept me so and they are refusing they are denying so it means that the 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 people who are uh, like uh, at that time like bani israel they have they were to accept the prophet also and the guidance that comes through the prophet because the prophet himself is not giving them the message the message was coming from allah the Prophet is only to convey that one. So the, like the Holy Prophet Sallallahu he got the message of Allah in the form of Holy Quran and some uh, that message with that conveyed by him to, to the people also. So this way the all the Prophets they came to convey the message of Allah. So Isa Alayhi Islam he came to convey the message of Allah. If a person who is denying the Prophet, he is denying Allah. So this way that person is in kufr. Is, is disbelieving. So this way, Isa alayhi salam, he said, فَلَمَّا أَحَسَّ إِيسَ مِنْهُمُ الْكُفْرَ So when Isa alayhi salam, he felt that these people, مِنْهُمُ الْكُفْرَ These people, Bani Israel, they are not to come back and they are uh, disbelieving now. قَالَ مَنْ أَنْسَارِ إِلَى اللَّهِ Then he said, uh, who is, the, who is uh, to help me towards Allah? Who is my helper towards Allah? So then, call al Hawari yuna nahnu ansarullah. Then Hawari people, they said, we are the helper of Allah. Amen, Nabiullah, because we believe in Allah. Washhad bi anna Muslimun, and we also certify with witness that we are Muslim. So this way, because Isa al Islam, he has seen that those people they have intention to kill him also, as those people they also killed Yahya al Islam and uh, Zakaria al Islam and also other prophets also because Bani Israel people they killed so many prophets. So the Isa al Islam he was expecting that these people they made the uh, planning to kill him also. So this way, and those people they tried their best. To, uh, to kill him, uh, but uh, but Allah took Isa al Islam and the other person who was made with the shape of Isa al Islam, so he was hanged, and they were expecting that Isa al Islam has been hanged, but that was not that was not true because Isa al Islam was taken by Allah towards the sky to the heaven, so this way Isa al Islam was not there. The other man who was made with the shape of Isa al Islam, he was hanged also. So <coughs> this way. 
uh, we understand here that uh, those people who were scholars of Bani Israel, they were having so much respect and regard within the society or uh, within the people of that uh, like country and that area. And uh, this way, and those people, they were also giving so much money and wealth and so many things, uh, the worldly things they were getting from the people also. This way, they were thinking that if Isa uh, Islam we accept him, then these people uh, will will not be in a position to respect us. The respect and regard will, will be lost from us, and also the wealth and the worldly benefits which were coming to us, those will be also finished. So this way, they tried their best to, in order to convince the the government also, so that they tried uh, to uh, uh, to put uh, Isa alayhi salam into trial, and then they tried. Uh, to to in, with the influence of the government uh, on the court and to convince them to to make Isa al Islam to the death sentence so that uh, Isa al Islam should be hanged, but uh, the but that was uh, done by them. But at that time, Allah has taken Isa al Islam and the man who was made with the shape of Isa al Islam that was hanged. But they understood that he was hanged. But actually, that was not true because that was Isa al Islam was taken by Allah to the heaven. So the main thing is that we understand here that uh, Hawari is like a companion, like the Holy Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam Sahaba. You can see here at the time of battle of uh, battle of ditch when the Holy Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam uh, he was uh, having uh, uh, the news from the people of Kuffar that those people they are trying to attack the Muslims, but uh, at that time, what happened at night? So there was Allah, Allah's Allah, Allah blowed the heavy wind with so much cold and uh, that has destroyed all the tents and all the uh, like the war war things which were may which were with the enemy kufar and they were destroyed and their weapons were destroyed and so much uh, disturbance uh, that was there in their place where uh, they were having all type of food items and other things they were destroyed because of cold wind uh, that was so much heavy at that time the holy prophet sallallahu said who will go to find what happened to the kufar so that time only one person, he said, I will, I am ready to go there. That was Zubair bin Awam Razi Allah Ta'ala Anu. The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said again, who is the person to go to investigate, to understand uh, what happened to those people during this cold wind and uh, then we should plan like for future, uh, uh, planning like for the war. So that time also, only one person, Zubair bin Awam Ta'ala Anu, he said, I will go. Because that night was so much, uh, it was hard to go because of uh, so much cold and uh, also the heavy wind. Heavy wind was so much. So, Holy Prophet Sallallahu said, third time, who is the person to go to get information from the Kufar? What happened to them? So that time also Zubair bin Awam Ta'ala Anu, he said, I am ready. So Zubair bin Awam Ta'ala Anu, he went there, but the Holy Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam at that time, he said, Zubair bin Awam Ta'ala is my Hawari, like Hawari of Isa Alayhi Salaam. He said, he's my Hawari, is, is the person, is my helper. So the Zubair bin Awam Ta'ala Anu, he got the status, this of Hawari from Holy Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. So uh, then he got the information about the uh, Battle of Ditch, what happened to them, uh, what happened to the Kufar during the cold and heavy wind. So we understand here that uh, at the time when a person is uh, going to preach the disturbance, the problems, that comes to the person 
if a person is just to have tolerance then allah's help comes to the person like we understand in surah muhammad uh, ayat number 7 ya ayyuhal ladina amanu in tansurullaha yansurkum wa yusabbit aqdamakum ya ayyuhal ladina amanu o people are of with iman o believers in tansurullaha if you help allah help allah mean help the deen of allah yansurkum then allah will help you wa yusabbit aqdamakum and allah will make your sound footing like allah will make give you so much force that you will be at sound footing in this world and the world hereafter because in this world you will enjoy the allah's special help also and at the day of judgment when you will be passing the bridge uh, that then uh, uh, that will be so much slippery and down there will be the uh, hell and uh, that time your foot will be so much strong that you will pass the bridge very quick and you will enter to the jannah so this way wa yusabbit aqdamakum so it mean the person who is understanding deen and after that applying deen upon his life like whole the life of a person is just under the deen e islam under sharia of holy prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam so then the person is to preach that one that islam to tell the people also and uh, then that person will get the reward like uh, yan surkum allah will help that person also wa yusabbit aqdamakum and allah will uh, make his uh, life be on strong footing in this world and the world hereafter he will get the reward also so this way we understand that preaching of islam is very important this way the isa alai salam he also uh, was thinking that now in the the allah's message i i am conveying to the people so it should not be stopped so it should continue this way he called the people he said qala uh, man ansari ila allah so is there anyone to help me towards allah so qala al hawariyuna nahnu ansarullah so this way hawari people they said yes we are the helper of allah so then isa alai salam trained them and he he sent them sent them to different places of the world and then they also preached islam so this was the message like we got here that we have to preach we have to learn islam understand it then apply upon in our life also then we have to convey the message of allah Uh, through, uh, through the sharia of holy prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam towards to the people also to people of the world so we have to convey the message so that we can get the reward in this world and the world hereafter amen